Hey everyone, it's Lady Kaka 101 and here I have a quick video to share with you guys. I went somewhere today and I thought I would share with you what I got today because it's really cool and exciting. Um, so I went to this kind of like toy fair thing. It's the Collector's Espo and they have like action figures and stuff. And they had some dolls there too, like Monster High and Barbie and stuff. So I'm going to pull out the stuff that I got and show you. All right, here they are. I'm going to try to do them in order of when I got them. So when I first came in, it was basically like all like um, comic book stuff and Star Wars and like a bunch of like 80s toys too. It was like a big like mix of like vintage like 80s and 90s toys and then like modern stuff. As you can see, they have Monster High dolls. And I saw this doll. They had two of them on the counter with a bunch of like random like comic book stuff. Two Fights Camera Action Draculaura dolls. And I got one. I thought this one looked better than the other, so I got her. She's super pretty, and of course since Dracula is my favorite, I had to snatch her up. And at first I thought like that was all the dolls they had. And so that's why I got her. And then I went to like the back room kind of. And they had like a big area of like Barbie and like Monster High dolls and stuff like that. And I wish I took more pictures to show you guys, but unfortunately I didn't. But um, when I went there at first I got this, even though it says 25 up here, the seller said he would make a deal and give me these individual ones in the packs for $5. And I got Miss Cleo from the Fear Leading 3 pack because I thought she was really pretty and the Fear Leading uniform could come in handy for Monster High Diaries. There's it, it is right there. And then I got this, which I am super excited about, the Britney Spears You Drive Me Crazy doll from the beginning of the video when she is the waitress. I'm so excited. She's so pretty. My first like inbox Britney doll. They also had Baby one more time but I already have that doll just not in her original outfit and I really wanted this one so I decided to get her and I got her for 20 not 30. I made a deal with the guy and he said he would give her to me for 20 so I thought that was a good deal especially since they go for so much on eBay and stuff. Then in the booth next to him, this couple was selling like a bunch of like vintage toys and like a couple of Barbies like this and bags. So I got this doll here. Um, the actually the seller that gave me the Britney dolls and these Monster High dolls, um, she they had Angel Face Barbie new in box for 35. And I thought, okay, maybe I'll come back and get her if I don't see anything else. But I saw this for three dollars. It was like half price. And um, I don't think it's actually actually fake Angel Face Barbie because she has the straight arms and Angel Face has the bent arms. But um, you know, like she has the outfit and her face is pretty similar, so like close enough. I don't really mind. So that's her. And then Barbie and the Rockers, Derek, who is also three dollars, and I really like him. He's super cool, and he like all original minus his shoes. So that's great. And then last but not least, I went back to the guy's booth because I had an extra $10, so I got these two for five. It's from Freaky Fusion Gulia, whose fashion is inspired by Jackie Laura. And that's the main reason why I love her. She's super cute. And then here's School's Out Frankie in the Day at the Mall Frankie fashion pack. She's super pretty. I love this Frankie. Wish she came with her original outfit, but I love this outfit as well. So yeah, that's all I got. I'm super excited. It was like one of the like greatest places I've ever been to. I hope to go to places like that some other time again. Tell me in the comments which item I got today is your favorite. And until next time, comment, rate, subscribe, and see you in the next video. Bye guys.